Hi, it's Alex. I don't know if you can see me because honestly I can't see myself through the screen because like the light exists. Um, but I just thought since I haven't made a video in a hot second, I really can't see myself. It's like really disconcerting. But that's fine. Uh, let's just hope my bangs look fine. Um, and my, there's nothing in my teeth. Because I just ate oatmeal. So it's very likely that there's oats in my teeth. And if so, I apologize. But pretty much today is the 7th of October, 2020. I have not talked in quite a second, quite a lot of seconds actually. So let me just give you an update about what is happening. So currently I'm in online school, um, which is which is interesting. Um, it, it's not ideal, but I mean, it works um, somehow. I think we've been in online school for what, like five weeks or something, which seems insane. It feels like we just started, but it also feels like we've been going for years, so you know. Whatever floats your boat, whichever way you want to look at it. Um, we have been doing online school. Um, what else? Let's see. Not much is occurring in my life as of now. Actually, lots of things are. Um, I'm sure if I just think about them hard enough. You know, it's really easy to procrastinate with online school. I'm not going to lie to you because deadlines aren't really a thing. They're kind of just like, as long as you have it done by the end of the semester, which is great. Except it's not, because I'm gonna just be that person who's like, ah, the end of the semester. That's not for a while yet. And it's not. But you don't, you don't wanna be doing everything last minute, um, because that's not a fun time. So, yeah, fun times. What else is occurring? I also just realized that my house is behind me, and that's like kinda of creepy, and just, that's, I don't like that, but that's fine. Um, oh, I just got a, reminder to win the water competition which is something I did by the way so let me just talk about that shall we thank you phone for bringing me inspiration to discuss um right so I was in a water competition for a month to see who could drink the most water because I don't drink enough water and I was like that's not good Alex but also the person I was competing against didn't drink water as well so I was like Really, the point of the competition was to get this person to drink more water. And it worked. Because they won. I lost. It's, it, it's upsetting, I know. I know. But hey, it's okay. I, I'm okay with losing because now the other person drinks water. Do I drink water? Still not really. But that is okay, okay. Okay, okay. It's, it's all good. Let's see, what else is occurring? Um, not much. Not much. Oh, I'm in a reading competition now with the same person who I was in a water competition with. Because since I lost, I was like... No, no, no. Let's do a rematch, but not with water, with books, because this is something I'm certainly going to win, hopefully. Right now I'm reading this book. It's called The Toll. It's the, is it the third book in the, um, the Scythe? Yeah, it is. It says right here. The Scythe series. Um, also borrowed from the person who I'm in the competition with. It's, it's, it's a whole, it's a whole weird circle of events here. Um, yeah, it's a good book. Not gonna lie to you. It, it's a pretty good book. Um, I kind of, forgot what the first two books were about so I went into this book kind of not remembering anything but hey it's okay it can kind of stand alone not really but it kind of does it's good because I remember enough that it makes sense so it's a good book I enjoy it um but yeah I have to read a lot so I can win if I lose I will be sad so let's not lose and I only have a month for this competition which is not a lot of time for a reading competition um but that's okay that's okay probably will only get like seven books in I hope maybe not seven seven's a lot right man I don't even know how fast I read anymore I have not read and like I read but like not as much as I used to so kind of interesting um what else oh yeah I haven't talked to <laughs> talk to people that's a lie I was trying not to talk to people for 24 hours because um I needed to stop procrastinating I haven't. So I guess it's not a lie. Go Alex. Winning at life. 24 hours is almost up, so it doesn't really count. And I'm talking to myself. Also doesn't really count because myself is like, I live with myself. So it's fine. It's fine. It's great. It's a beautiful day outside. Highly recommend you go outside and enjoy the weather. Apparently there's a hurricane coming, according to some sources, aka my mom. But I don't feel it. It seems too nice of a day to even imagine a hurricane existing, existing, excuse me, in this world at the time, but obviously it does somewhere. Yeah, I'm sure. Let's see, what else is occurring? There has been so much that I can't even recall. Um, uh, I am cool. 
don't know. I that we already knew that. That's kind of old news. Um, right? Cause uh, yeah, I was watching the first video. Yes, I rewatch videos on occasion. Not really. I just I was going through YouTube. I was looking at my friend Grace's YouTube channel. Just and I'm like really admiring her work over there. And then I was like, let's go look at yours. And then I got sad because I was like, wow, this is not as good. But that's okay. The way it's set up is like bad. But that's fine. I will fix that one day. Uh, anyhow that's irrelevant so i was looking at my first video and i was like interesting that was six months ago the first day that all of this started six months ago my friends six months ago that's six months ago that's a long time that's half a year that is insane that makes me confused anyhow so then i was like wow you haven't you also haven't posted a video of me talking since your birthday my birthday i don't know why i'm speaking like that april 29th by the way so that was in april and it's now october so that's quite a long distance that's a whole summer that just went by wow okay so that doesn't seem that it was that long it also seems very long it's very weird i'm confused long story short alex is very confused about everything right now that's fine confusion is fine also again i cannot see myself at all like also because my um fingerprints are smeared like all over the screen i need to clean that especially because we're in a pandemic but i just can't see myself so just if i'm looking weirdly like trying to look at my banks I i'm sorry i just really cannot see what's happening um, which is fine. It's fine. Uh, I might just delete this whole video if I realize my bangs are like lopsided or my oats are in my teeth, you know? It, it, it happens. It happens. What else is occurring? Um, I don't even know. Uh, what are some fun things that are happening? Life. I went on a hike once, uh, multiple times actually. Hiking is very fun. I recommend... Also, horror movies, top tier. I've known this for a while, but horror movies are so amazing. I just like them. I like them a lot. I went to a corn maze the other day, over the weekend. Uh, I did not complete it because uh, we got lost. And yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna lie to you. My sense of direction does not exist. It, it does not exist in this dimension, in this world. Um, right, so right now I'm currently on my lunch break, um, but I also have a study hall right after this. So I'm not doing anything until three o'clock. Which is fine because I actually need to do some math homework um, right when I hang up this video or not hang up, leave this video call or video. Um, right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Right when I leave this video, I'm going to do my um, math homework. I hope unless I procrastinate, which I probably will do, but let's not talk about that. Um, right. Uh, let's see. Oh, you know what? Let's talk about something deeper than just my life. Okay. Well, it relates to my life, as most things do when I talk about them. Otherwise, you know, why would I be thinking about them? Anyhow, that's horrible. I should really... That's not that bad. I mean, is that normal? I, I think about things not relating to my life. Of course, of course, of course. But in this video, it's about my life during quarantine, my life during a pandemic. Therefore, I feel like I should speak about my life, you know, for it to be relevant. Um, right, so like I was saying, before I rudely interrupted myself, wow, what a creep. Anyhow, creep, it's a good word. Recommend you use it. People get confused, they get offended, they don't know how to feel. It's a wonderful um, universal word. Um, yeah, that was not my point though. My point was technology is bad. Um, <laughs> not bad, okay, obviously technology is the only thing keeping everyone alive here. Um, not only technology of, for medicine, that is very important, I do agree with that. I agree with technology. I just, ugh, I just sometimes wish I were born long ago in the 18, uh, 1800s or something like that, you know? But hey, that's a stink bug, you little creep. You're waddling like a duck when you only have four little legs. Anyhow, um, oh, I hate those things. Uh, right, I was talking about something. Right, technology. Right, and obviously technology is the only way I'm going to school. Uh, without technology, I would not be in school. I would not be learning. I would just be reading. Oh, it's a little dust particle floating in the wind. Right, but technology. Also, technology is the only way I can talk to people. That's the only way I've been able to communicate with my friends, mostly. Minus the ones in my neighborhood, um, which are three of them. But I've also, like, that's also how I've become really good friends with some people. So it's kind of a conflicting thing in my mind. I'm like, technology don't like very much but I'm using it so much so it's kind of I'm confused yet again in this matter because um right like it's 
I hate being so dependent on it. You know, before the whole pandemic was a thing, you know, people were all like, yeah, like, don't spend so much time on your phone, you know, and I'm like, yes, I agree with that 107%. However, now, now, that's like, that's the only way you can talk to people, it's the only way you can learn, it's the only way you can communicate, like, what, 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 man, I have no idea how people survived the Black Plague, because... I don't know if they just ignored it and they're just like, let's go visit everyone. Or if they just stayed cooped up. They wrote letters. That's true. Mm, but letters could carry the... Mm, I've written some letters. Letters are fun. Glorious things. I recommend. Anyhow, like I was saying, you know, technology confuses me. I know it's a good thing, but at the same time, I'm like, eh. eh. So here I am trying to take a break, but obviously it's not working because look, I just made a video. So again, conflicted, confused. That's Alex right now. But I hope you all are having a wonderful day. I hope you had a wonderful summer and prepare for the hurricane that may or may not be coming. I have no idea. I haven't really researched that or even checked if that's a thing, but my mom said it was. And she's usually somewhat correct. So have a lovely, lovely day and go do your homework. Don't procrastinate like me.